All right, I'm getting subbed out here. I just brought it back within two after a three. Let's see what our bench unit can do. Oh my! It it it, it was what forty five to forty seven. It is now seventy two to fifty four. What was it? Four minutes left. You're telling me they scored twenty seven points in four minutes. Oh my god. I mean, it's so down. Probably the worst thing you could do, to be brutally honest with you. Like, why would you sub me out? Last time we did that, we were down by 20. Nearly 30. So, I do. Uh, yeah, lead leaders. Yeah, Lamel's leading the leading assist. How bad are we down? Down by 22. So, you're telling me there's a chance. And now the starters are in, and we don't even have our starters in. So, you can chop this up as an L because the coaching here is magnificent, bro. I tell you, Rick Carlisle. Is coaching a master class. I can't even control my character. Why is he running over? Oh my god. What is LaMelo doing? I didn't even run that far. And he's over here doing the goddamn mile run. Like what? And he hits. Uh, this game's over. I mean, yeah. You subbed me out with a minute left. Yep. Yeah. Now's the time to sub me out. Why? Because I have three three or four fouls. Now you saw. Yeah. Bring me back in with two, two seconds. And they bring, I just noticed, they, we have an all, I'm not even defending that. We have an all guard lineup out. The game's over. We're down by 30. What did they do? They sub in a bunch of guards. While the Spurs are running all centers. But make it make sense. They have all centers and power forwards in the game. We have all point guards in one center. What sense does that make, 2K? What sense? Well, they subbed me out with nine seconds left, dude. <laughs> Oh, please just end my misery. Please just end my misery. All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to this my NBA career, and we are coming off a 50-point performance against the worst team in the league, or second worst team in the league behind the scouts. Uh, Washington Wizards on Christmas Day. DeAndre Ayton had a monster game. I had 50 and 10 with five steals on amazing efficiency. And yeah, as you can see, shooting splits for the Wizards was not good. Avita gave them a great game, but it wasn't enough. And as you know, we were supposed to play the Clippers uh, in this episode. But if you saw the last episode, if you didn't, you should probably check it out. Link will be in the top. No, like, link will be description below. Top right. You already know how it is. But as you know, we made a few big trades. Uh, if you don't know in this series, if a superstar is on a team that is awful, I'm trading them. And uh, Giannis is now on the Spurs. Yes, the Bucks. this is going to be the second losing season in a row. They lost Chris Middleton for agency. Um, Drew Holiday was regressing, so I decided the Spurs were already the third seed. They had plenty of young talent. Giannis is on the last year of his deal, but he has a player option that I would probably accept. The Spurs are going to make a move. It's a win-now move. They signed Anthony Davis for agency. So there was a massive trade that sent Giannis to the Spurs for Isaiah Collier, Keldon Johnson, Miles Bridges, Jeremy Sohan, and uh, like two or three first-round picks. And then Rudy Gobert was also sent to the Bucks for Drew Holiday. So that was that massive trade. Those few other trades that were kind of smaller, not as big. But we're going to have to face that team today. We are currently sitting at the two seed. Five games back of the Cavaliers, who we swept last season. So that's interesting. Two and a half games ahead of the Pacers, who we were fighting with a playing spot last year. So we're doing pretty well for ourselves heading in to the mid-season point. But now we have to go against the Spurs team. But let's put our stats into Synergy 2K first. Here we are on Serenity 2K. All the stats from that Wizards game is in. We got the win, except that we now have 45,000 XP. If you did not know, I also edit my player in the offseason, not during the regular season, because in 2K, progression happens in the offseason, so I figured that's just the best way to do it. Anyways, let's go up against Giannis, AD, and the new possible championship favorite, San Antonio Spurs. Oh, oh my God. Who did we trade for Laurie Marketing? Wait a minute. How did we just get Mason Plumlee's back? Didn't I trade this guy? No, I didn't. What the? What just happened? We traded Jeremy Grant for Laurie Market, and I did not do that trade. Ain't no way. We traded Jeremy Grant in a 2026 first round pick, lottery protected, for Lowry Marketing. Alrighty then. Lowry Marketing is going to be a new starting power forward. I cannot believe what just happened. Here in Charlotte, 22 and 13, third seed Spurs going up to 25 and 9, second seed Hornets. I cannot believe we, man, I would have loved to keep Jeremy Grant. 
because he was actually having a really good season. I was starting to like him. But if we are getting a Lowry marketing, all-star Lowry marketing for Jeremy Grant, um, and a lot of protected 2026 pick, which I'm not even going to be playing in 2026, bro. Right? And let's be honest here. For an all-star, we, we just robbed them. We just robbed them. That is insane, and it was all automated. My GM did something good. Our GM did something good. Now, going up against the Spurs. Uh, I, did we already play them this season? Am I tripping? I swear we played. Oh, no, no. I played them on my own before Giannis got traded because that's when Malachi Bronham dropped 30 on my head. Uh, but we're going to test out Lowry first. Lowry marketing from downtown. It's off. Oh, AD to the bucket. Lowry marketing. Great contest. But Giannis is there for the putback. Like this duo. Not much we can do about it, bro. Twin Towers with Giannis and AD. It's just insane. I mean, we now have a 7-footer on Lowry Markkinen, but he is not known for defense as I hit it off Giannis' leg. Take it back. From downtown, Cedric Lewis is going to knock it down. Cuts the lead to four, and the Spurs have had all the momentum in this game. As you would expect with their roster, it's just absolutely fantastic, dude. Un unbelievable they have veterans they have young players it is just perfect malachi brana misses we get the rebound Mel ball beats out uh anthony davis he had me back door but he decided not to go for it and i am going to draw the foul there that's malachi brana second oh Aiton with the big steal i'm down court lamello doesn't see me i saw okay marketing he hit it Lowry marketing with his first points as a Hornet. Oh, I got subbed out. Didn't even notice. Uh, that only down by one. I will definitely, definitely take that. Uh, they got their starting unit back out. We have Najee Marshall guarding Giannis. Yeah, what did we expect would happen? And now Giannis with the switch. Got Lamelo on him, but that double team worked. And he missed the shot. We cannot be running small against this team. Let's be honest here. So I'm going to go up, get the and one with a chance to tie. Yeah, as you can see, Giannis already with 16 points on 70% shooting. Just having his way with us. But they're going to keep leaving me open on that pick and fade. And I'm going to keep making them pay. Lamella Ball being aggressive. A little bit too aggressive sometimes. I'm going straight to the basket. They try and draw a charge. It's not going to happen. Tie game once again. We are just running through Cedric Lewis himself. 26 first half points. All right, I'm getting subbed out here. I just brought it back within two after a three. Let's see what our bench unit can do. Oh, my. It, 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 it was what? 45 to 47? It is now 72 to 54. What was it? Four minutes left? You're telling me they scored 27 points in four minutes. Oh my god. As one of the best teams in the league, you're allowing that to happen as I'm going to miss. Down 20, we need a stop here. And I'm not going to get that because I had to help LaMelo Ball on that defensive possession, bro. I do Stop giving LaMelo the ball. He has done absolutely nothing. None of you guys have done anything in this game. AD's only got 8 points and we're down by 25. There's no way. There is no way this man has eight points that went down by this much. I mean, it's subbed out. Probably the worst thing you could do, to be brutally honest with you. Like, why would you sub me out? Last time we did that, we were down by 20. Nearly 30. So, I do. Uh, yeah, lead leaders. Yeah, Lamelo's leading the leading assist. How bad are we down? Down by 22. So, you're telling me there's a chance. And now the starters are in, and we don't even have our starters in. So, you can chop this up as an L because the coaching here is... Magnificent, bro. I tell you, Rick Carlisle is coaching a master class. I can't even control my character. Why is he running over? Oh, my God. What is LaMelo doing? What is happening? Bro, I can't even control my character. I didn't even run that far, and he's over here doing the goddamn mile run. Like, what? And he hits... This game's over. I don't even think I have a steal in this game. Because I can't get one. They have glue on their hands. I can't take the ball. I mean, yeah, you subbed me out with a minute left. Yep, yeah, now's the time to sub me out. Why? Because I have three three or four fouls? 
Now you saw, yeah, bring me back in with two, two seconds. And they bring, I just noticed, they, we have an all, I'm not even defending that. We have an all guard lineup out. Bro, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm about to fire. I'm about to fire Rick Carlisle. I am going to fire him. It's gonna happen. Bro, I'm so sick of this game. So sick of this game, bro. I can't stand playing this video game anymore. It's the idiot. Just stupid. It's just stupid. The AI is dumb. The game's over. We're down by 30. What did they do? They sub in a bunch of guards. A bunch of guards. While the Spurs are running all centers. Like, make it make sense. They have all centers and power forwards in the game. We have all point guards in one center. What sense does that make, 2K? What sense? Well, they subbed me out with nine seconds left, dude. <laughs> Bro, please, just end my misery. Please, just end my misery. We lost by 33. All because I got subbed out down by two, and they let him go on like a 27-2 to run. I don't understand how that happens. No help. 53 points. Next, 14, Max Struess. No, Nick Richards. Like, where was LaMelo? Three for eight. Aiton, two for four. Like, I don't understand it. It doesn't make sense to me. Over here, Giannis... Jo uh, bro, I don't... How You you let Kira Lewis drop 11. You let this guy drop 11. You let B Heal drop 11. A Davis only had 16. Portis had 17 off the bench. Malachi Branham, once again, had points because I had to help on every goddamn defensive possession. And we had Larry marketing on Giannis. I it doesn't it doesn't make sense to me. It doesn't make sense to me. They went 19 they hit 19 threes. On 53% shooting, they hit 19 threes. 58 points in the paint. I bench points. They scored 58 bench points. 58. I we were in this entire game until they decided, "Oh, we're not going to play basketball anymore in the second quarter." I'm not going to play basketball anymore. It's embarrassing, dude. I'm so sick of this game.